So I'm packing for Arizona and metal detecting. I've got my pin pointer, my digger, all that stuff in this bag. I think I've hit a snag though. So the shaft will fit in here. I'm gonna have to lay it across here like this, but uh, here's the problem. <laughs> uh, this is not, I might be able to fold it in there. As for the coil, I don't trust putting that in my luggage. That's got to go in my carry-on. I just don't trust them. 350 bucks for a new one? I'll take that with me. I wanted to show you guys how much dirt I forgot at the end of the season to clean this out. So just from removing the cover, wow, there was a ton of crap in there. So I'm, I'm glad I'm going on this trip because I forgot to clean that out and I'm still not done. There's still lots of dirt in here, so... Look at that guys, clean as new. But that is not the important thing I'm showing you here. I've been married 23 years, this tip will save your life. All you new guys, married less than three years, look at the sink, okay, clean. The wife will never even know I was here. So this is secondary to your survival. This is a priority. She doesn't need to know you were ever here and filled her sink with sand, okay? You just listen to Unfrequented World and you'll be detecting for many years to come. Alright, 17 inch laptop stowed. Now I just got to get all my camera gear in there and the rest of my detector. It's not the adventure part that kills me on these trips, it's the filmmaking part. I wanted to bring so much more gear than that, but that's, uh, that's all I can fit in this bag right now. Two lenses. And the phone. Maybe I can sneak the GoPro in here when I'm done somehow, some way. But, uh... Oh, I'll make it fit. Somehow. Somehow, I'll make it fit. Come on, shovel. You're going to Arizona. Grab an end, Gage. Grab an end. Oh, oh, there it goes. Hey, look at that. Ha! Ah! Not quite. Somehow I'll get all this gear stored and I'll see you guys in Arizona. I'm sick of looking at that white stuff. I'm just so excited to see sunshine. I'll see you guys there. Arizona UFO right there. It's not a star. It's probably an in orbit, uh, non orbit satellite. It's a UFO. <laughs> Truck switch, hour and a half to go, and hit it. Well, that's it, we're here guys, Arizona. 15 hours travel time today, so it's like 11.30 hour time. Gotta get in the house, unpack, 
get that detector put together because tomorrow morning, first light, I'm going out here to hit this desert. They say you can find gold nuggets in the Arizona desert, so we're going to see if the Equinox can pull something. I don't know. I've got a few washes I want to check out. I've been told about multiple ghost towns, abandoned mines, abandoned ranches, all kinds of good stuff that I can hopefully check out over the next 10 days. So just got to get the detector put back together and get at it.